In this video, I'll be sharing my exact TikTok ad strategy for testing new dropshipping products. So by the end, you'll have all the tools and resources you need to grow and scale your brand on TikTok. But before we dive in, if you're new here, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more so you never miss any future content designed to make you guys more sales. Now let's get right into it. Over the past few months, I've been testing various approaches, analyzing the data, and refining my strategies to create the perfect system that I'll be sharing with you today. From creating scroll-stopping content to targeting with precision and optimizing for the best results, we'll cover it all. I'll be sharing real-life examples, case studies, and a step-by-step -step walkthrough to make sure you're a TikTok ads expert by the end of this video. All right, so I wanna start off in the TikTok Creative Center. If you guys haven't accessed before, this before, you can find it at ads.tiktok.com. Just go ahead and create a free account, and it'll bring you here showing you exactly what I see right now. So what this does is it's gonna show you all the top performing TikToks for a certain time frame. So right here we have the last seven days selected, but there's a ton of criteria that you guys can um, select and narrow down up here. So for industry, you guys can select the niche that you're in. So if you guys are selling pet products, you can select pets right there. You guys can do pet food, pet grooming, pet treats, pet toys, depending on what exact product that you're selling. You know, leave all that blank for now. Same with objective, you guys can select conversions for sales. You guys don't want app installs or lead generation unless you guys are trying to promote an app or a marketing agency or something similar. I recommend leaving likes and duration the same, same with the last seven days. So it's gonna show you all the top performing TikTok ads over the last week. So you guys can scroll through these and see what's performing well, what's resonating with each audience, what the top performing ads are in your niche, and what they're using for hooks, content, transitions, uh, their call to action. You guys can get so much ideas from looking at the TikTok Creative Center. I highly recommend going through your niche and seeing you know, what the top performing products are, what the top performing creatives are, because your creative is one of the most important parts of this process. It's literally the content that promotes your products and makes the sale at the end of the day. So yeah, I just highly recommend going through here, looking at some of the top performing creatives. I also have another video where I explain the exact process of what goes into a winning TikTok or a TikTok that you want to go viral. I'll leave that link down below in the description, but it covers your hook, your content, adding controversy, any elements to add virality, your call to action, and it just shows you what goes into a good overall TikTok. But before you get started with TikTok ads, I highly, highly recommend having at least two to three creatives already made that you guys can test against each other so you guys can find the clear winner and scale that one up. Now, before we dive into TikTok and set up our actual ad campaign, I wanna show you guys where I get all of my video ads made. This is Viral Ecom Ads. They're a company that you can send your winning products to and they'll deliver you video ads within one to three days. These are ready to go, proven to convert ads that you can plug right into your TikTok and start generating sales right away. Because let's be honest, if you guys don't know what you're doing with your video ads, you guys can waste hundreds if not thousands of dollars testing videos that don't perform, or you guys can eliminate that problem entirely by working with these guys and get a ready to go, proven to convert video ad made for you. I'll leave their website linked down below so you guys can check them out and get some of these video ads made yourself. But they have so many different packages for you to choose from depending on what you guys need. They have your video ads, your UGC style ads, your animation ads, and so much more. Since we're talking about testing on TikTok in this video, you guys are probably interested in their video ad section. We can look at their different packages right here. They have your split testing video ad package, which is four ad variations for your one winning product. They have a single video ad package right here, and they also have your TikTok split testing package, which is three ad variations for your product, which is probably the one you're gonna wanna go with since we're testing out on TikTok ads and you guys want those three different creatives testing against each other. But we also have our split testing vertical ad package for our stories and our reels, as well as our combo ad package, which is a video and three animated clips for your product. So when you guys are ready to purchase a video ads package from Viral Ecom Ads, they make it very easy to do. You simply go to the video ad package that you are interested in, select the quantity. You guys can actually save more money by bundling up and buying more ads at a time. You guys select if you want TikTok text displayed over your ad, as well as a TikTok voiceover. Then you submit the submission form with information about your product that you are selling. They'll deliver your ad within one to three business days. And then you guys can submit a revision form if there are any revisions that you want made on your video ad. So the choice is yours. You guys can download video clips from around the internet, piece them together and hope that it performs well or you can purchase one of these done for you packages and start generating sales from day one. Once again, I'll leave a link in the description below if you guys are interested. Before we move into this, you guys wanna have three videos made that you're going to be promoting. 
Also, if you guys haven't already got it, go ahead and download my zero to $100,000 TikTok dropshipping guide. You'll find that linked in the description down below. It actually shows you how to make $100,000 on TikTok without any paid ads until say day 15 or whatever. And you start off completely on TikTok organic, making your own content, building a store around it, and it shows you everything you need to do. I highly recommend downloading that free guide today. But anyways, to get started, you guys just wanna go on campaign, click create. It's gonna bring you to the objectives right here in just a moment. All right, so your advertising objective, you always wanna go with conversions, do website conversions. Some of you might be tempted to click, uh, select product sales, but this is still in beta, so it's not you know very good yet. Uh, there's still a lot of tweaks and optimizations that need to be made before that one is you know really the go-to one. For your campaign, you guys can name it whatever you want. I would name it your product test number one. And then we're gonna go ahead and turn on campaign budget optimization or CBO. We're gonna put a budget of $50 because that's the minimum that you can do for TikTok ads. Once you guys have done that, we're gonna click continue. All right, now we're setting up the actual ad group or ad set. So just go ahead and rename this whatever you guys want. I'm just gonna call it ad set one. You guys wanna select your pixel for your store, whatever that would be. Although sometimes you can actually leave pixel unselected and it'll optimize and perform much better without. So I actually recommend trying a campaign with your pixel selected, running it for a few days, seeing what kind of results you can get on that, and then running another campaign without any pixel selected and see if there's a difference in conversions or conversion rate or anything like that. So go ahead and select your pixel that you have for your store. For optimization event, we're going to do complete payment. Ignore all of that add to cart stuff down there. For placements, we're gonna do select placements. We only want it shown on TikTok, not Pangle. And then we're gonna click advanced settings down here. You guys wanna turn off user comments. A lot of times comments are actually, oh shit, turn off. A lot of times comments are actually gonna do more negative for your ads than good. You're gonna have people commenting like dropshipper, or scam or something like that. So you just, you just wanna avoid that entirely. Same with video download. You don't want other advertisers downloading your videos, ripping your creatives and running them on their own ad platforms, taking your sales. Uh, you guys know how frustrating that can be, even though you know we do it to other people all day long. Um, targeting, you guys wanna select your location down here. I usually do US and Canada, but you guys can target any locations that you want to. I recommend leaving languages blank unless there's a certain language that you wanna target within each region. Same with gender, unless you guys are selling a product that's oriented towards one gender over the other, like a female you know, beauty product or like some male you know, sports product or something. I recommend leaving gender blank. Age, you guys wanna select 18 plus. You guys don't want any 13 to 17 year olds taking their parents' credit cards, buying your product, and then you guys will get stuck with a chargeback one month later. Just avoid that entirely and target only 18 year olds with their own jobs, credit cards, payment information, all of that good stuff. Household income and spending power you guys wanna leave alone. Same with audience down here. Now I know TikTok has a ton of advanced interests and behavior targeting that you guys can run with, but it's actually better to just leave it broad and let the algorithm optimize on its own. It's super advanced, it knows what it's doing. I recommend just leaving all of your interests and behaviors and all of that blank. Let it optimize for you, all right? TikTok knows what it's doing. So targeting expansion down here, you guys would turn that on if you selected certain interests, but since we didn't select anything, we're gonna leave it completely broad so we can leave that off. Uh, we have our budget already set on the campaign budget optimization level over the campaign. Um, we're going to select our start time for our ads to be the next day. All right, so select your schedule to start the next day at midnight. And then we can also do day parting. So you guys don't want your ads running all throughout the middle of the night when people are just staying up and watching it, not buying anything. So I recommend doing eight to midnight or around eight to 11. You guys can experiment with that. But overall, this is the best time to run your ads and let them optimize and make you a ton of sales. Scrolling down, you guys want your optimization goal to be conversions, your bid strategy to be lowest cost. We can click advanced settings, but we're gonna ignore all of this and we're gonna move over to our actual ad or our creative. All right, we're here on the actual ad now where we'll be creating our creative to be displayed to our audience. 
So under add name, you guys can call this whatever you want, or you can just leave it blank, but I'm just gonna call it creative one. Um, you guys wanna leave that blank, go ahead and set up your custom identity. It's just gonna be your brand's logo with your brand's name. It's gonna be the account that it's displayed under. So you guys can see all of that. I'm gonna have it blurred out right here so you guys can see the brand that I'm actually running this with. But it's just gonna have your brand name down here, your logo up there as the respective account. You guys are gonna select single video. Under add creative, you just wanna upload the actual video that you made, just the first one. For text right here, you guys can say whatever you want. You guys can say, get it for 50% off today only. But just know it's the actual creative or the video that's doing all of the selling for your product. So whatever you put right here really doesn't matter all that much but you guys just wanna reiterate your offer right there. So if you guys are offering 50% off and free shipping for your product, make sure to put it in the text right there. For call to action, it has you automatically selected on dynamic. Change that to standard and just make sure shop now is selected. For some reason, when it's under dynamic, which it automatically has selected for you, it's gonna show a ton of different variations of your call to action. So it's gonna show like learn more, sign up, and you know, stuff like that when none of that really matters or applies to your brand, you, you guys just wanna uh, select shop now. That's really what's going to be selling your product. Scroll past this to destination under URL, just type in the URL of your product page or the landing page that you guys wanna promote. It's gonna take them there and that's where you're actually going to make the sale. Scrolling down, you guys wanna unselect that box because you do not want your ads displayed on the TikTok Creative Center where we just were at the beginning of this video because then other advertisers are gonna see the content that you're promoting, steal your products, steal your content, steal your ads, all that good stuff. Even though we do that to other people all day long, we don't want them to do it back to us. Scrolling down, make sure your TikTok pixel is selected for website events. Leave all of the other stuff blank. And then when you guys have set up your first ad, you're gonna scroll over to the right right here and you're gonna click add and you're gonna create another ad. And then if you guys have three videos, you're gonna create one more and you're gonna set up your third and final creative. And once you guys are done with all of that, click submit. And then we're gonna duplicate the ad sets so that you guys have three ad sets running with two to three ads in each under your campaign budget optimization of $50 a day. So you're gonna let TikTok go through tomorrow and optimize this for you, let it run throughout the day or your selected time that you have it running. And you guys should start seeing some results. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others. And don't forget to subscribe for more in-depth tutorials, marketing secrets, and more. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below and I'll be sure to get back to all of you. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.